First, two children are seriously hurt this Halloween night. A young trick-or-treater in Pasco County is hit by a truck and flown to a hospital. And a seven-year-old girl is shot while trick-or-treating in Chicago. This is Nightside. I'm Carolina Lead. We begin with that child hit in Pasco County. It happened around 7 p.m. at Town Avenue and Starkey Boulevard in Trinity. That's where Nightside's Angelina Salcedo is live tonight. Angie. Yeah, well, this Halloween definitely took a tragic turn here in the Longleaf neighborhood in Pasco County. That young boy was trick or treating with a group at around 730 PM tonight when a truck didn't stop and accidentally hit him. They were trying to cross this crosswalk and he was with the group. You're going to see the crosswalk right here. As soon as he pushed the button, they saw the lights flashing. But a woman that I spoke to that saw it all unfold tells me that she actually didn't see that the group was crossing until a truck driving down Starkey never stopped and hit that young boy. Now the woman that I spoke to was a one of the people who called 911. She says she never saw the group crossing until the truck hit the little boy. It was too dark for her to see and that's something that neighbors in this area are talking about tonight. They think more lighting needs to be placed in this area or officials should have been out here making sure that kids and their families could cross the street. Now she and other witnesses that I spoke to are understandably shaken and did not want to go on camera tonight, but they do tell me that they hope that little boy is doing okay. Um, we do not know the condition of the little boy at this hour, but we do know from Pasco fire that he did have extreme lacerations to his forehead and had to be flown to be treated right away. Angelina, thank you for that update.